<laughs> oh, <it's> so nice. <laughs> and that's the intro. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, lip strand or bumble, you saying you needed vases. What do you mean? The elbows are dry as hell. No, I had to no tell they Philly. Look. Now they're calm because you put Vaseline on them. No, I didn't. Bet you did. Did you do use Vaseline? No. Yeah, I realized. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, that's, 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 it's jarring, isn't it? What? It's got like cream all the time. If you don't cream, it just comes up mad white. Because okay, you know when skin. I jump out of the shower, mm. I only cream what's visible. Is that just me or is that everybody? Yeah, no, that's where. Yeah. Okay. I don't, I don't cream my feet. Yeah, yeah, I yeah, changed yeah. that. I used to do that. Like when I went to school, I didn't cream my legs, just arms, face, and neck back, because neck back's visible. Yeah, I get dry. But now I cream my legs. Is it? Yeah. No, I'm still not gonna get cream. Anyway, um, yes, welcome back to the Chunks and Philly Show. And today I've got um Iconic one of the man. core members of YouTube, someone I grew up watching, and it's funny because I'm older than him. Uh, he's actually one of my favorite YouTubers from back in the days. He's, he had an iconic intro, but he stopped doing it. And that is Comedy Shorts Gamer here, my brother, I Dej. <laughs> now, Dej. Yeah, what's up? Very happy to have you here. Yeah, no, very, thank very, you for very having happy. me. No, You're man, icon, icon. icon. Thank you. Dej is a, a, a close friend of the Beta Squad and love having him on there. So I thought, why not bring him over to the Chunks of Philly podcast and let's just have some conversations. So how you been, brother? Chilling, honestly. Just yeah. living my best life. Alhamdulillah. Uh, moving soon. Okay. I can't wait to move. Nice. Yeah, where been... I am, I, I can't, I hate it. Where are you moving to? What's the postcode? Door number. <laughs> <laughs> but before we get into that, today we actually asked you guys to send us in any dates. Like Obviously with Valentine's soon approaching, if you've had any date nights in Nando's and what was your worst experiences? I think surely everyone's had a little date in Nando's, innit? Yeah. We actually had some Nando's off camera as well. And it was a yeah. date. It was three of us. Oh, did a little Sunset Ergs. What you, okay, Sunset Burger. This guy doesn't speak English, by the way. I have to flip in because a lot of people don't understand. What? <laughs> sunset Ergs. Sunset Ergs. It's a Sunset Burger. You just take out the B and then you think you can... Yeah, but it just sounds, it sounds cool, innit? All right. Well, Deji, what did you order? Because I know um, Deji's order. I know he likes a bit of wings. No, I've got Peritema wings. That's yeah. it, really. Yeah, yeah. Peritema. I've got Sunset Ergs. Yeah. I can ease. Mac and cheese, you know what? Never mind. Like, That's like never easy. Yeah. <laughs> and, and what's what sauce level? Uh, extra hot. Are you? Oh, peri like tamer. I don't, I don't know. Is that? Yeah, no, you spare tamer. That's solid. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's number two, though. If you like a real Nando's heads, though, you know the best flavor is peri flamer. You know what peri flamer is? Incorrect. That's like hot, hot, isn't it? No. no, it's barbecue with hot. But I still think correct answer. It's amazing. The correct answer, and these are these are. It's very niche, though. Only if you know, you know. Garlic barbecue. <laughs> No, I've not had the garlic barbecue. Of I can't even speak it's on it. It's too... I can't even speak it's on it. It's upper echelon. Now, Nando's, if you're watching, please, please bring that back for yeah. me at least. I just put my name on it. I want, and then when they took away the raspberry keys... Yeah. And Nando's, can you also do this for me? Put Perry Flamer on the order menu. Because you, you can only get it when you're in Nando's. Oh, it's like, if you know Nando's yes. and you're a regular yeah, there, you yeah, know yeah, that yeah. it got a little Every special sauce there. Every time I go there and they try to tell me... Um, have you got any, listen, I've got no allergies. That's the thing, two sides. I already know, you yeah. know what I mean? Have you ever been in there? When they come in to ask you if everything's okay, I say, just take yeah. the little thing, man. I, yeah, know, yeah. I know what you're here for. You're not here to actually ask me. <laughs> <laughs> but we're actually going to move on to the problems yeah. that people have had in Nando's. Now, a girl said, the reason she left the date is because the guy drank Perry Perry sauce straight from the bottle. Then that's wild. What would you do, yeah? If you were on a date and the girl obviously has got a little medium sauce and then she starts backing it from the thing, what are you guys actually going to do, like genuine? I'll be real. <sighs> yeah. It kind of tells me that she's adventurous. <laughs> so I like that. No, I'm with him. Yeah. No, genuinely. Look, I, I, I'm looking at it two ways, boys, yeah? One, I love that you're just so comfortable around me mm. and you can just be yourself. But second, I do get secondhand embarrassment sometimes when I'm in public. Like, I, I like to conduct myself in a certain way. <laughs> do you get what I'm saying? <laughs> but like... I would want her to do that if she that's what she does. Mm. And I'd want her to pick up the chicken with her hands and not act weird yeah, because chicken you're with eating hands in front fine. of her. Mm. Eating with chips and not worrying much about the fact that she's got maybe a pair of nays on her lip. That's fine. Mm. Drinking Perry drink, well, that the sauce from yeah, a bottle. I, and, the, and the bottle's is, big, you know. Yeah, the bottle's like that. that's and you're putting your lips on a bottle that everybody's no, going to end up using. You didn't say lips. The drink straight from the bottle. What yeah, does that but mean? That, yeah, but she could have skied it. Yeah. <laughs> that's still a problem. Why do you need that much sauce? But who did it? A girl or a guy? So, oh, she said the guy. So obviously oh. this is a girl speaking from her perspective. Oh. I'm just saying if we were on a date, because unless we go on dates with guys, I don't know, you guys tell me. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm asking you. But I feel like I've, I've, I've had a bad dating experience in Nando's. Go on, give me one. 
Shoot a plane. Oh my God. I that think that's a, criminal yeah, behavior. Yeah, you know? yeah, 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 really? yeah, yeah. You, what, what? Have you ever, so when they ask you what sauce do you want and have you ordered plane before? Yeah. What? Oh, so you're also a serial killer. Was well, that weird? Yeah. No, cause sometimes I just don't want that, like too much flavor in my mouth. I kind of just want to like, yeah. That's crazy and to me, you know. No, because that's when it's wild. plain, it's still quite, it's, there's still flavor there, but it's just not. Yeah, chicken flavor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, I, I want some Perry something on it. Yeah, I need something. Yeah, I don't, I don't know about all of that. So that was your traumatic experience. Yeah, that she got and plain. Did, I was did you think, ask her? Like, no, yeah, I don't think I like went into it like, yo, that's mad that you did no, that. But I'm like, oh, right. what you got plain? Like. Not even a lemon and herb. She goes, no, spicy. <laughs> like, no, genuinely. Yeah, like she, she, she even thought sometimes when it was plain, it could still be spicy. And I'm like, no, maybe that's just your palate. Yeah, yeah, the palate's different still. Because mm. plain for me, that's a problem. Yeah. Have you ever any, had any like any mares in, in Nando's on, on dates or nah? Oh, uh, I'll be, I'll, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I've enough. never taken a girl to Nando's. Is on it? a date? No. no, never. Oh my God, Honestly. you should. No, sure. but do you know it's what? It's so casual and nice, and it's like, you know, there's no pressure on it. I, I love it, oh, man. I, I can't lie, it's bait, though, isn't it? It is bait. It, it is bait. bait. It is bait. Yeah, yeah. Everyone goes, Nando's. You are, you are Deji. Yeah. <laughs> but, <laughs> so let me ask you this then. Do you guys eat differently? So, like, for example, when I'm in Nando's, I'm going to eat how I eat usually. I couldn't care less who's in front of me. So, on a date, are you eating differently, like, in front of her? Yes or no? So, I'm a loud eater, I can't lie. Oh, that's disgusting. What, you good? No, no, not like that. Oh, just kind so of more like. Yeah, he was in you know, off the break earlier, and it was, it did sound clammy. <laughs> clammy, <laughs> yeah, he's mad. He's clapping. Yeah. Do you know what? it's the big lips? That's it. Mm. Yeah. You know what I mean? so, so what do you mean you eat loud if it's not making that noise? So it's not like I'm having my mouth wide open while I'm chewing. Give us an ASMR it's... now if you eating. Huh? Give us an ASMR. Yeah, that's problem. That's problem. Really? That's my not... <laughs> in my no, ears. you know, you know what I've realized? That's an ick for me. You know? Is it? You know, like you see when someone drinks a drink here and you can hit a. <laughs> Yeah. Kenny, that's Kenny. That's a, Kenny that's a mad ick for me. You know? yeah, 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 is it? Yeah, like, look, well, I'll drink now. Look, Go. so for the audio listeners, I'm going to have a drink, uh, a sip of water out of uh, my Chunks and Philly show mug, and you'll hear no. <laughs> look. And then tell us, show us the example of people that you don't like. Okay, I get that. Ain't that icky to you? I get that. I get that. I think that's icky. No, yeah, you don't need to do that. Yeah, like, yeah all right, that's you fair. can definitely sit without having a mad gulp. So, are you eating normally and then in front? Yeah, hundred percent. I use my hands, man, because I always like to get the thigh and the leg piece. Yeah. So then I break it together, yeah, so yeah. it's like two pieces, yeah. and then I just hold the drumstick and yep. then yeah, eat it in my yeah, hand. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah, yeah, there's yeah. certain bits of the chicken that you can't get with a knife and fork. I feel like, mm. and I like the top white bit of the bone. Mm. So you've got to like, you know yeah. what I mean? Oh, you like the cartilage? Yeah. yeah, it's nice. Do you like it too? It's so good, isn't it? I love it. I, that's cartilage still, I can't lie. You don't do it? <laughs> that's like, bro, that, you know what I mean? You don't have to do that. No, anymore. my dad was a criminal. You see my dad, yeah? Yeah. He used bone to, marrow. Yeah, but he used to, but like, he used to get our bones and go. The bones? Yeah, oh. and, then, like, and then spit back out on the plate. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's yeah. yeah, That's my that's mum right there. That's, yeah, it's yeah, the same, innit? Yeah. People, people you know bone marrow's a thing though, isn't it? What? Mm. My mum is, is licking down the lamb shanks See, all right, just to get then. the bone marrow. <laughs> <laughs> just to find a young little bone marrow. It's crazy up there, man. I say, bro, like, mum, it's not, you know what I mean? 1946 no more. Like, we're, we're good over it. <laughs> My date took me to Hernando's where his ex worked. Oh, yeah, Wait, was problems. their ex at work? Yes. That's problems. I think, you know what she was trying to do? She was probably trying to get a discount. Yeah. No, but I'm, obviously- It's spiteful. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, trying that's to, what I'm yeah, trying to get trying to be like, Look, I've moved on. No, no, no. I'm looking at in terms of the the bad dating experience you've just read. I'm looking at that the person's doing it from a spiteful angle. Like, yeah. Look, like I'm with a new one. Like, yeah, yeah. Well, so and you, you've you, got you, to serve me my food. You've got to bring it to the table. Yeah. 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 So you wouldn't want to do that for her. What? Do that. If to she her? said, if she said to you, "Can you come to, on a date with me?" And then they, you go on a date and you're in Hernandez, but she sees her ex is over there. No, that to me would be like you are a nasty person. <laughs> yeah. Because yeah. it's either you want him back. Yeah, and they're doing or that. Or well, you're yeah. just, do you get what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I, I, don't, know I don't see a positive in that. Yeah. It's that's, just baggage, a, that's a hell. It? Hmm? it just feels like baggage. That's yeah. You feel, you feel kind of you're rebound. The re yeah, 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 the rebound. Yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. All right, then my date took my free Nando's mill from my Nando's card. <laughs> <gasps> I used to love stacking up yeah, my yeah. Nando's card. To the point where I had like red rewards, about four of them, and it almost expired. Yes, they expired. I was stacking. I was stacking it for too long. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. What, would you do? what would you do now if, if she said, oh, I got this, I got this, um, babe, like I got the munch. She goes up and she goes, yeah, one, eight, three, four, four, three, two. She's trying to say her card right, number. Cool. Right now, as this new filly, 
Minor, babe. Enjoy yeah. that meal. You see old school days when that, bro, I used to go Nando's, check that app instantly and yeah. go, all right, cool. What, what, am I, what bet am I on now? Yeah, Do you get what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah. Back in the days, I would have been livid. Yeah, yeah. Livid. Green Awards. Oh, what a good time, man. I used to use that for flipping starters. Main, you can only get the main, nothing else. But yeah. the thread, you're getting the full, heart, the whole thing, the platter. And, the, and there's something about getting like that discount, innit? Do you yeah, get what I'm saying? Yeah, like yeah, there's yeah. something about getting that discount. Yeah. I had a Nando's card, little red joints, you know, I remember that. times. Okay, <laughs> this one's crazy. What do you do on a date for Nando's? And then it's just holding up the plate, licking it. Like there's no more food left in the world. Like the, the sauce is there. Obviously she can't get enough of that pair of tamer. I'll be honest, I don't even do that at home, let alone, you get what I'm saying? Yeah, in yeah. Nando's. And I feel like when you're on a date, you got to have a little bit more respect, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that though. <laughs> you know why? No, it's it's cost efficient. Like she wants to get every little Last, bit. You know yeah, what I mean? Uh, so I'm, I like that. Yeah. yeah. I, I think I like extravagant things. You know what I mean? I like, I like, I like it Don't when- do use that word, yeah? <laughs> that's crazy. That's what it is. I love veggie, you know? I actually don't love veg. Nah, that's wild, man. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Girl said, good first, good first date story at Nando's, and now he's my husband. That's very good. Nando's is the reason she got married. That's what she said. Wow. <laughs> that's man. Okay, go on. Do you guys know where Nando's is from? It's, listen, there's South African There's influence. been this massive debate for is years. Is it Portuguese isn't it? or South African? Comment down below what you think. We're going to confirm the actual answer now is... South Africa. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. yes, yes, yes we right. saw someone nod yeah. like that. So South we're confirming Africa. it is South Africa. Wow, that's why they got all that I'm a piano and kind of music on the... I'm the a back. piano, bro. I've gone in there and heard salsa though. Is it? 100%. And how about this? There was this. I've seen it on TikTok, yeah? People eating, they were showing uh, South African Nando's. <laughs> Is it crazy? It looked mental. Because you know us, like for example, anytime I go like Canada, because they've got different menus, Canada, isn't it? When I, whenever I go to like uh, the Middle East or when I go to Australia, I'm always like bigging up our one. I'm like, you know, they have Illumi sticks. You don't have, like I'm saying stuff like this and I'm eating it and I'm like, there's nowhere near UK's level. But South African people that come to the UK to have it, they're always like, <laughs> no way. That's what they say, so. Well, I suppose if you think about it logically, innit? If it was, Created there, it has to be the best. They, they gotta have like different local and that's elements. That's why I'm gonna go to South Africa for purely for the Nando's. No, I'm going in December. Is it? Yeah. Bring me back in Nando's. I'm going with Sharky. You're oh, lying. Sh Sharky didn't buy you. He, he <laughs> did. I just said I was ill that day. Ah, oh, yeah. Um, anyway, moving on swiftly. Um, I, don't, so, I don't know why Sharky's going. Yeah, he enjoys right, it Because right, okay. he's the man up there. <laughs> <laughs> <I was> like, <laughs> mm. <laughs> if now. This was your last Nando's meal ever. What are you having, Philly? Great question. I'm ordering half a chicken. Yep. Perry chips. Yep. Coleslaw. Uh-huh. Perry nays. Yep. We got gooey caramel cheesecake. Goodness me. Jeez. And a Fanta. That's me. That's a good meal, man. Well, you don't ask for a Fanta. You just say soft drink, can yeah, you? Yeah, just yeah, go yeah. do it Ten yourself. On, yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. Yeah. Uh, Dej? Uh, Perry Tamer wings. <laughs> yeah. You, well, you just deal wings. with the wings. You don't get nothing else in there. Oh, you like what you like though, innit? Yeah, yeah, no, I'm a very, very boring person when it comes to food. Yeah, no, nah, no. Nah. So like, for instance, like Chinese, same order. You just stick always, to the same thing all the time. Always. No, do you know what? I'm just, I'm kind of scared to like, Branch out. Yeah. Yeah, cause, yeah, cause, yeah, yeah, you're safe. Yeah, just keep it safe. I hear that though. Yeah. Me, you're not gonna ask me that? So moving on, um, I'm joking, go on. What would you- I'm, I'm adventurous with like women though. Don't get me wrong. So like, <laughs> when it comes to women, like I love different flavors, everything. How have we gone from your last one at Nando's? Gingers? Yeah. Top tier. No, redheads, crazy. You like that? Top crazy, tier. Crazy. It's only because they make up like 2% of the world. No, is that a fact? Like no, that, yeah. they're, they're all freaks. <laughs> yeah, okay, right, before okay, we get into that chat, yeah. uh, what would be your last meal? I'm gonna, I'm gonna say my last meal at Nando's ever would be butterfly breast paratema, double chicken wrap paratema, if I can have garlic barbecue, I would, but obviously, but if not, Paratema. The mac and cheese, that needs to stay there forever. I know it's on a winter sun, but yeah, just stay there with me, please. Yeah. And then, hello, me sticks. Yeah. Sunset burger. Yeah. Bring back the- Basically, the whole menu. Just the whole menu, man. I've, yeah. had, I've had fun here. And, and Nando's. Appreciate you. Guys, man. Redheads, there's actually got a fact here about redheads. It's less than 2% of the world's population has red hair, making it the rarest hair color in the world. It's the result of the mutated MC1R gene. If both parents carry that gene, their child has a 25% chance of getting lovely red locks, even if the parents don't have red hair themselves. Now, would How, you, That's mad that I said redhead. And yeah, it just came out randomly. Yeah. That's nuts. 
It's I not like we got a producer, like, yeah, you know, yeah, writing yeah, stuff yeah, and yeah, we, yeah, we get yeah. to see it instantly. Oh. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but do you know what I discovered the other day? I've what? never seen in real life black ginger babies. Have you? A Google black it. Ginger? I've go- I've se- there's black ginger kids, bro. Never. Google it. Ma- yeah, unless it's photoshopped, Google it. Yeah, it's probably <laughs> Do you reckon? <laughs> black ginger? What? No, they don't exist. Don't uh, tell me that was a Photoshop picture and I'm not gullible. Or maybe they just dyed it. I don't think. Am I that gullible? Oh, snap. Yeah, you can. You probably... like, I didn't read information to be fair. I just clicked on images. Oh, there is. Is that really ginger though? Yeah, that's Show brownish. Me. Yeah, that's ginger. That's kind of brownish. Maybe. I don't know. We're just... I, I'm, my brother I'm ginger, ginger, man. Yeah. But could, could that potentially be the truth? Maybe. Ooh. Okay, that's more ginger, yeah. She's ginger, yeah, but she's uh, light-skinned. Yeah. I mean, yeah, maybe I could have been, maybe. <laughs> Do you have any babies in the world that you don't know about, Deji? Ah, uh, um, I hope not. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but we're actually going to move on to obviously the fact that we do have Deji in the podcast studio. So we're very blessed for that opportunity. So oh, I want to ask you. you, brother. Yes. Deji, what is your full name? Uh, my full name is Ola Deji. Ola Tunji. Full, full name is Ola Deji Ola Wala Lutunde Daniel Lutunji. But just Deji. Deji. Um, so <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember any of it? Uh, Olo, Olo Deji. Ole, no, Olo Tunje. No, That's Olo Deji, Olo Tunje. But you can say Olo Deji, Olo something, something, something. Yeah. Daniel, Olo Tunje. Yeah. Wow, that's great. Did it take you a long time to try to remember that? No. So tongue twister that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, well, no, my mum helped me. I was like, what does this say? What does that say? Because I saw Wale, so on your passport, W-A-L-E. I thought I said whale. On your passport, <laughs> there's that many lines. It's like, is it going no, all no, the way so to I, the end? No, I got rid of all that. That's, that's way too long. It's Ola Deji, Ola Tunji. Yeah, just Ola Deji, Ola Tunji. So wait, so wait, what does Ola mean? Because I know I've seen a lot of people with Nigerians. So, Hello. So Ola, yeah. so there's, de- there's like different ones. It could be like from royalty. Oh. Yeah. Um, so my name is The Joy Has Come Twice. Deji is The Joy Has Come Twice. Ah. Uh, so, yeah. That's nice. why. It's mental. And then Ola G Day, what's that? I actually don't know. Your brother. I don't know. Oh. That's nice. He doesn't know his brother's name. What's what's Jay's full name? Ola G Day, uh, Ola Tunji, or Ola TJ, Ola G Day, or something, 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 something. Daniel. Yeah. Ola Tunji. No, so I'm Daniel. He's William. William. Yeah. William. Yeah, William Shaw. Hey, what's happening, Will? Next time I see him, I'm going to go, gonna what's happening, Will? He's going to be confused. Yeah, yeah. Hey, He's William. Confused. <laughs> no, he'll know William. He's, you reckon? Yeah. So, okay, it actually says here, this is probably a bit of your, your Wikipedia. It says that your fa- your family, or his father, Olajide Olatunji Sr., was born in Ibadan, Nigeria. His mother, Yinka Olatunji, Ni Atin- Atinuke? Atinuke. Atinuke is from Islington, London. Uh, Wait, how how do what, how do they know this? Yeah, you know, I think about this all the time. No, as I'm well. saying you're Deji. We have to know this about you. If you guys know, you know. You know that where that's from? How do no. they know where Nardwa. my dad's from? About the, what? Yeah, and then you, um, he and his parents are from the Yoruba ethnic group, correct? Yeah, and you were educated Yoruba, at Yoruba. Berkhamstead. Oh, uh, Yoruba, yeah, of course. You're educated at Berkhamstead School in Berkhamstead, where you future met like the Sidemen member Miniment as well, because that was no, your no, brothers. Yeah, so yeah, that's oh, it. is that yeah, way? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so she just met Simon at Berkman City School. Yeah. Oh, yeah. cool. Yeah, you mentioned mm. that to me. So yeah, is your dad from there? Huh? Your dad from Ibadan? Yeah, Ibadan, yeah. Yeah, and that's because of the fact that we did our research. We Obviously, when we have people over, we yeah, we, make we, sure we know. You know what yeah. I mean? Thank you, man. Fair play. Appreciate it, man. Fair it's not play. wiki. It's not Wikipedia now, no, We man. actually... Why would Wikipedia we have It's so long, though, because we go through like loads of videos that yeah. week. Yeah. And then go down to your archives. And we actually went to Nigeria ourselves to yeah. Ibadan. And Who was it us. we met? What was the man's name? Oli... Legend. Only legend. Yeah, yeah. legend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you look yeah, you yeah, no. No, <laughs> and, and Tunde, we... Tunde was there? Tunde. Tunde, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Michael? No. That was Ghana. That was the Ghana. Yeah, trip. yeah, Ghana. That was about Michael. <laughs> Stormzy, never mind. Yeah. Um, we actually want to move on to, and I'm going to ask you quickly, mm. how does it feel having a brother that is, obviously you're successful, but... You know, yeah. the JJ is different levels. Prime, like he's the, of, one yeah, of the, yeah, yeah, one of the goats of the UK, probably the goat of the UK. Mm. Is YouTube there any sense the world, of yeah? Know. Is there any sense of pressure being his brother? Wow, chunks. Good question. Yeah, right? Good question. Yeah, very good question. Um, so pressure. I'll say a little bit, yeah, because I mean, kind of, and not really, because we were quite different. We want to do our own like different avenue. So I'll be honest. So with me, I'm more of like a the creative side. I'm I'm, I'm more of like a 
creative, I'll say. Yeah, so yeah, let's yeah. say I'm, I'm, I want to like go into the direction of like directing. Yeah, I'm like, oh. like, like, yeah, like storytelling type. Oh, yeah, yeah, wow. Yeah. So that's what I want to do eventually. But pressure, I'll say a, yeah, a little bit because yeah. obviously there, there are, I've seen like he's put like a, like he set, he set like the, Stand, uh, the standards. Yeah, the standards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's kind of just like, whoa. But, but, yeah, the, but then why do you like, feel pre- if not, if anything, I want to know. So I say pressure because I want to like, not essentially like achieve what he's done, but get to like somewhat like the same level, mm. but in my own right. avenue. Yeah, 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 of course. So, and what, does, does he give you advice? Like in terms yeah, of- Yeah, all the time. But, 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 but like, what type of advice is he giving you? Like what, what have you gone to him for? And what do you need help with him? What do you feel like? He's the advice that he's given you that has actually helped you in your career. So, girl advice. Yeah, I've I've gone to him yep. like because I've asked him like, yo, so the way I talk to girls, the way I do this, yep. is that like the right way? This yep. blah blah blah. And like he's kind of helped me in that aspect of course. because like older brother. Yeah, yeah. So that's the thing. Do you, do you, sometimes do you forget that he's not to forget your your older brother, but like it's kind of like. Difference, having that difference of the fact that he is KSI mm. and then when at home, obviously he's Olu you know what I mean? Mm. Like, cause then have you, have, do you have that sense of, you've kind of forgotten what it was like to just be brothers off camera? Cause obviously like you, you grew up together, of course. Mm. And it's like, but now a big chunk of his life now is him being an absolute superstar, same as you. Mm. So it's kind of like, have you guys not lo- lost that sense of like just being brothers and, and knowing, you know what I mean? Like it must be like that. Honestly, no, no not really. Like Christmas time. Yeah. It was so chill. It was actually like how we used to. Yeah, be. I remember that last like, Christmas. I oh saw yeah, I saw some. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, saw yeah, those videos that. go we're viral. Just, we're just playing yeah. games. We're watching movies and everything. We're just talking like this. Yeah. It was it was actually like how it used to be. Yeah. Type yeah, stuff. Yeah, like yeah, we're just yeah. playing games amongst each other, just like playing FIFA, all of it. It was, it was so chill. And I loved it. Have you? Do you think you've changed over the last like five, six years? And do you think your brother's changed? It's a weird in, one. In what, so, in what sense do you, are you asking him? Maybe just changed? in terms of maturity we, levels mm-hmm. and okay. maybe just because of the fact, obviously the, the debacle that they had during that Christmas yeah, yeah. once, like how has things improved? Cause there's no point of talking about that. I feel like everybody knows about what happened yeah. um, in, in the in the Christmas at the house. But from that situation, you guys have obviously grown and, mm. and much closer than even before maybe. I'm saying has much changed and what has changed? I mean, I'll be real. After our whole beef and whatever, mm. it only brought us closer. Yeah, of course, of course, as, so, it, as it should. Yeah, so I, I wouldn't say I, I'm not. I'm not the type of person to have regrets. Yeah, you know what I mean. Yes. So when it happened, I wasn't. You know, yeah, it happened, but I'm kind of blessed now because this has made us what we are now. Mm. Like I can literally text him whenever I want, and he responds like that. Yeah, of course, like super quick. Yeah, and um, imagine he did it now to half hour. Yeah. To half- <laughs> Us, yeah, when we try to talk to him, yeah, like, right, because he should we test it right now? What you're gonna call him again? I'm gonna call him, and then if he doesn't pick up, I'm gonna see if Desi called if he picks up. Okay, okay, because he done this before, yeah, yeah. He was like, Oh, what I chat to Kesa every day because mm. I was saying basically get Kesa on the pod. He was like, What I chat to him every day, that's my brother, like we talk there, mm. and I've gone call him then, then answer. Wait, should I call first? Nah. No, because nah, oh, he don't want to call, call violated. No, 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 I'm trying to get violated, bro. I'm saying let me call first and then let him air me and then let him call and we pick us up. We'll cry. Yeah, go on, let's see, let's see, let's see. So now, um, we, we tried this before, guys. I tried to call KSI JJ, right? And he I don't know what, what he didn't pick up. But then guess what? He replied to me the day after saying, sorry, I was busy. So can we confirm that that's his number, by the way? Yeah, that's his number. Just read it out. Um, <laughs> All right, let's go. What, what do you want to happen here? To, to, to answer? answer. You, don't, you want him not to answer? I want him to answer. Okay. <sighs> but by the way, don't tell him you're with Deji if you do. Yeah. Unavailable. Wait, what, have you got his WhatsApp? You don't even ring him normally? No, nah, I call him WhatsApp. No, you ain't got his normal number? This is, that's a normal number, right? Yeah. Well, ring him normally. All right, please. Okay, now let's... Okay. He might have blocked you. We can confirm that he has not picked up and it didn't even ring. If now... No, if it's the same situation, that means his <laughs> phone's off or... What? What, what, why, why is Chris sending me that? What? Don't say that. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> you can't really mention it. But yeah. go on, call, call. No, that was <laughs> mental. <laughs> That's mental. That, that... Considering the conversations was having off cam. Please, just call your brother. All right. So if it goes to voice mode or says unavailable straight away, yeah, I'm his happy. phone's just in airplane mode or just no, 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 no battery or something. 
That's hilarious. He's FaceTiming him. Oh, that's cheeky. That's not fair. I don't know about that one. What? He's FaceTiming him. It's the same thing though. You tried to call him through Wi-Fi and then tried to call him through Signal. Same thing. Oh, he's not picking up. Put yeah, yeah, down, down, down. Down, down. Yes! Yeah. Yes! He's just busy. You might be just busy. That's his brother as well. Say that, man. Phew. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, a last question about, about JJ. Yeah. Deji, what kind of person do you think you are without JJ? Without JJ? Yeah, do you think you would have made it? I'll be real. In terms of like YouTube, like, so, oh, that's a very... Oh. As in like, did you have interest in YouTube? Yeah. I've been doing YouTube since uh, 2006. But I'll be real, if it wasn't for JJ carrying on, yeah, because I started YouTube first. But then, oh. Yeah. But then um, I kind of just stopped, but he carried on doing like FIFA clips and everything. And then when I saw like what he like- Was became, building. Yeah, yeah what yeah. he was building. I was like, damn. Then I just hopped on, you know. So if it wasn't for JJ carrying on, yeah. I probably wouldn't have been, I probably would have stopped. And what's your favorite video that you filmed with your brother? Is it the ones from back in the day? Damn. I'll be, I'll be real, I'll probably it's like a- the horror, of, like the horror vids, and like a conglomerate. Uh, yeah, you know what yeah, I mean? yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Just in them in general was your favorite. Yeah, but that's maybe because of the fact that you like the casting thing and you like to actually produce and stuff. Mm. So maybe because like you felt like you were involved mm. when it came to like structuring the video and stuff mm. like that. Maybe right. Yeah. All right. So, so what? So what? You're trying to be. You said you wanted to be a director. What? Do you, mm. Like what, direct in what sense? Is it like adverts? Are you talking films? Yeah. Like? So no, films wise. So when it comes to me, when I'm watching a movie. I hate watching movies that I can just easily predict. Oh, yeah, so yeah, do I. Yeah, yeah. I'll be real. Like, I like Dwayne Johnson. I can just predict his movies like a man. Kevin Hart. Oh, my Ke God. Oh my I was gosh. watching his film recently on uh, Netflix. What, Lyft? Brother. Like, I knew the ending before this. The Sometimes film. they're easy watches, though. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Like, yeah, yeah. Like, like, Kevin Hart, he is one of the goats. He's probably the goat, uh, 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 what's it called? Comedian, based off numbers, of course, not based off, like, preference. Mm. But, like, movies, I'm just like, I know all of them. Yeah. Mm. But shout out to him. It's incredible what he's achieved. Yeah. You know what I mean? Um, but then like so like movies that I like watching so like I've got like a top three Irreversible is a French movie so not seen it yeah he's serious it's, it's a double entendre when I say like a double entendre so what happens in the movie is irreversible because it's like based around something quite bad as well as you can watch it from back to front and front to back and get the same story <laughs> yeah but it's, it's one of those movies that you can't watch twice but it's a good movie would you recommend what? watching it then? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I only need to watch it. That sounds Top amazing. Three, so another one. Um, the Skin I Live in, Spanish movie. The twist is a mad twist. The Skin I Live in. This guy's got mad Spain twist. What's it about? Apparently, it's a crazy film. Nah, I can't ruin it. I can't say what it is without ruining it. You, but, you, it but it's based around. I can't. Oh. Just, okay. Just explain gonna, it. Yeah. Explain it. Explain it. All right. So it's basically based around. Oh, because if I say it, no, then I'll ruin it. Oh no, man! Just okay, please. go on. Say it, say it then. Just say it. Oh, you, you can lose Yeah, it. yeah. All right, so it's basically based around a guy who's basically um, augmented this girl's skin. But there's more about the girl. Watch it. I actually want to watch it, so That's I'm it. avoiding listening to that. Oh, that sounds amazing. Yeah, good, amazing. What's okay, we're going to move on. Last, um, no, last one, last one. So, you know what? I've got four, actually. Oh. Um, old Boy. A German movie. No, no, no. <laughs> so, oh, no old, old Boy is a Korean movie. Yeah. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> now that is a mad twist. That's a mad twist. Let us know if you understand what the films he's even chatting about because so old, old boys, Lawrence like, is just yeah, not in the have you, uh, approval. But we need to write these down for me then, Lawrence, man, so I can watch these we'll later. I've got his number, number man. Yeah. I'll just text him. And then uh Prestige, another one. Indian movie? No, uh, no, that's an American movie. <laughs> yeah, no, okay. no, good cast. Prestige. Uh, why do I know that? Yeah, uh, good, uh, oh, um, Hugh, uh, Hugh Jackman, yes. Scarlett Johansson, yes, 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 oh. Christian Bale. Yes, 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 all right, well, I'm definitely going to watch But no, that's what I like. I like. So then he, he, here's films. a question based on that, yeah? Like you're, off camera, I'll tell you like an idea. Yeah, right? you're, you're, you're in a man, you're a man that's in a position of power mm. and financially you're good. Mm. What's stopping you from doing something now? Like even something like a short film to mm. introduce yourself to that world. Mm -hmm. Like there's so many short films mm. on YouTube, for example, that are great films, you know? Like why haven't you just thought of just, I don't know, look, put two pounds into this and let's create mm. a, a little 20 minute film for YouTube. You know what I mean? Mm. Cause I feel like as big as you are, I feel like you need an entry level into that world. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? It's like the same way with me doing music. Like there's no way I, I let's just say I didn't have no songs on the internet. Yeah. Man can't now reach out to some like big boys now 
to like huncho and and ads and then go, oh, let me get a feature. It just doesn't make sense, bro. Do you get what I'm saying? So mm. why don't you just start small? Why don't you do a short film? So no, that's what I want to do. I want, oh, what, so I want to do a short film and then go to like one of those film festivals and, pre and like present my my short film. Yeah. Maybe I might win an award or something. But I want to start. So with me, I want to kind of conquer the boxing first before I kind of conquer crazy before I um dive into that because it was I, I'll get into it. So I was kind of thinking of like stopping boxing. Why you I, love it though? No, that's the thing. I love it, but I. I I have like this mentality of kind of, I'm like quite lazy, like after a fight, I kind of just snack and everything. So <laughs> I- wrong with that though. Yeah, no, but then I, I get like- a Big, big, big. Yeah, I get big, yeah. big. <laughs> so okay, how much, when you're fighting, what do you weigh at? So I'm trying to go down like more and more weights. Cause like right now, so I, let's say I fight like light heavyweight, which is around 175 pounds. Much What's that KG? I only know KG. Like 79 kg. 79 kg. Yeah. So, so you fight. I'm, yeah, I want to probably fight like 165, like even lighter. Okay. And then yeah. what do you balloon up to? Like 86, like 87. Oh, so yeah. you're getting like eight, nine kilograms. Yeah. Mm. That's quite a bit. Mm. But a lot of people, our walk around weight is completely different to there. Is it just maybe when you get back up there, going back into camp is much more difficult. You're like, I can't be yeah, asked. Exactly. Mm. Okay. Okay, cool. So yeah. So then, but then you, you say that, but you've had over five fights now, right? Yeah. So it's like, you obviously have, do have some sort of work rate if you are managing to- I mean, some of the jump. fights are kind of- Some of the fights were, some of the fights were? You didn't take serious at all. Wow. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Why do you think he had losses in the beginning of his career? Because I think right now, if he was to redo the matches, bar maybe Jake Paul now. No, I would smash Jake Paul. You reckon? Now. Yeah. I, I always get hate when I say this. I don't care. I know I would beat Jake Paul. As in, if now the example they said, what day are we in now? We're in, let's say we're in January, right? Mm. If I say to you, October 8th, mm. Jake Paul, you're fighting him. Yeah. Hand on heart with everything you believe in, you think you're taking him. Yes. And why is that? Is it because you fought him already? I won't say it's, I fought him already. It's uh, one experience, two confidence, three, I, I just, there's not really much about him. Oh, sorry. This is, this is not really much about him. Like mm. in terms of- uh, You took he his does, shots? He does, he does, yeah, it doesn't, yeah, I've taken he, he hits, I can't lie, he does hit hard. Okay. When he hit me in uh, head guard. Yeah. He, ra he rattled me. Yeah. Um, yeah. But then again, I also. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but then he's saying that you're the, you're the only person that's made him bleed, that's right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he made his nose was busting. Yeah. <laughs> he's beat some serious guys, though. Mm. Uh, UFC done? Well, I just. Uh, and this is over. Uh, and the other one? Tyron Woodley. Mm. Are they not serious guys? They're serious mm. guys. Are they not filled, but he's versing them when they're expired, bro. Like mm. he's very smart with how he picks his fighters. I respect Jake Paul. I think he's very good at what he does, yeah. but I also think it's smart the way he takes his fights. The only fight he took that people were like, hmm, maybe, which was Tommy Fury, Tommy Fury beat him. I'll be real though. I don't think a content creator can come out, yeah, and start boxing boxes. They can't, bro. So you don't reckon? No. No, I re Jake Paul is good. I he's, very good. I, he's very, I mean, very, good. very good. I think Jake Paul is, me personally, I always think he's the best, I'll be honest. Jake Paul, you think he's the best? I think my opinion, yeah. I'll, I'll say JJ Generally. Edges. If JJ was to fight Jake Paul, I think no one will know what happened. I would never ever be able to say Jake's gonna win or I'll say JJ's gonna win. You get it? Because for me, JJ is a close second. That's what I think. But you I, actually think Jake Paul's the best? I, think, I don't know much about boxing. That's why my opinions are very minimal here. Yeah, I think I think he is. But I think like on a content creator level, bro, like it doesn't it, it, at the end of the day, if now JJ has a fight with Jake Paul tomorrow and there's 10 fights, let's say. It can be 5-5 five, five, or it can be 6-4 to Jake or 6-4 to JJ. Do you get it? Yeah. I think it's like, it depends on the night. Yeah. But I don't think, as in, I've seen, my favorite fight I've seen was would be a Jake Paul fight, as in, in terms of the way he dominates his opponents. Like, he's really taken out some big hitters, in my opinion, in terms of the YouTube scene, but not necessarily like, as in actual boxes, boxes. But with Deji, I think that was the closest, after the, obviously he lost already, uh, Jake Paul, right? Yeah. But the closest to a loss would have been the, the Deji fight. Wouldn't you, wouldn't you agree? And that was both of them when they at the similar levels. Has Jake Paul lost? Yes, yes. to Tommy Fury. I don't really care. Yeah, but I'm saying, I think, I think if Deji is now saying he's seen him fight and he thinks he knows about him, mm. but it all depends on how serious you take your camp. Yeah. That's the most, no. most important thing. See, with me, it's a, it's a mindset thing. If, yes. if, if my mind's not in it, I know I'm not going to perform. Yeah. But then sometimes Similar. I feel like- So why do you think, you, my bad, sorry, brother. Why do you think you've lost the, 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 the fights then? That's my mind wasn't in it. The Jake Paul fight, I can tell you for a fact, I, I kind of- Literally the beginning of the fight, you can see I'm just standing in the corner, hands down. I'm just like, what's going on? But 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 at that like, time, ding, ding, ding. at I'm that just, time, yeah. it was you versus Jake, your brother versus Logan, right? Mm. Such a big card, so much riding on it. Mm. Didn't well, how couldn't you be up for it? 
It's not, it wasn't that I was up. Mm. I wasn't up for you it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, bro, if I'm if no, my older brother's that. about to fight next, which I've adored, I know you've mm. idolized your brother, which is fine because mm. I did the same with my own brother. Mm. But it's like, you know what's riding the Olatunji names on mm. that night. Mm. How have you not been able to go? I'm fucking locking in and I'm smoking him, and then I'm gonna come back out and watch my brother smoke. Logan, answer that question. You know what I mean? I got a point to say based on that, but go and answer the question. I, I'm not answer it truthfully. So in terms of like that, it's laziness. I'm I'm gonna tell you right now, it's laziness. That's that's what it is. It, it, when looking back at it, to yeah. like how I am now, yeah, I was just lazy. I I I kind of just I was hoping I could. So I've always been quite. Like athletic yeah. and like like athletically gifted, yeah. like I could just kind of see someone do something, and I, I can just do it. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So I kind of just took that with boxing. I kind of mm -hmm. just thought maybe I can just just do it. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, just yeah. like just jump in and it'll be easy. So then, but you, with boxing, you can't cheat boxing, no. and, and I learned that the hard way three <laughs> times. Yeah. So like that's that's the honest honest truth like i kind of just i didn't really care but then don't you think that sometimes you could work really hard for something and it's just not your day on the day bro yeah of course yeah, genuinely like, yeah, bro it's possible. Yeah, like, it's I, possible i truly but no because i hear your point about yeah like big night a lot riding on it but he could have truly worked hard no, obviously in this he case didn't. i know but i know in this case he didn't i'm yeah. just saying that mm. hypothetically like you could have truly worked hard and you're on, on the day bro he's just a better man yeah like, no, no, it, no, it no, actually I, gets I, like I think, that I think there's nothing bro. wrong with that but i think what Deji would probably have a hard time seeing is the fact that when he goes back into the change rooms and he's with his team and that, and he's thinking his head, I didn't even, why didn't I put more work in? Mm. Well, that must be the first thing. No, yeah, that, that's, that's always been the case. Like my, my uh, three losses. Yeah. I was always like, why can't I put more work? Vinny so, uh, even, even, Hacker. You know, even, I can't lie. I beg you, I was just about to say, yeah. can you tell me who you lost to? I, Jake Paul, I watched, Vinny but Hacker not that much. Jake Paul, Vinny Hacker and Alex Wasabi. Yeah. So the Alex Wasabi I, fight. I, I, you I, lost to that Wasabi. Yeah, but shall I, be, shall I be with the Alex Wasabi fight? Which pissed me off. You were dodging so fucking well, <laughs> but he wasn't throwing. <laughs> like, so, bro, uh, he, and this is when you, it's your first fight under daily, right? Mm. I remember all of this, bro. So I'm watching was him. It, well, did Kenny fight that day? Yes, Kenny. Yeah. Was I there with you or not? Did, no, I don't Kenny think so. fought um, Temper. Face Temper. And lost. I, w I was. I don't know oh, if you're there. Know. But I'm saying, I remember that day and I remember you were flipping, bobbing, weaving. Mm. You were reading each of these punches. I'm looking in my head. You've read all of them. How about now you start throwing? What was the reason that day? Because your mentality must have changed under under daily, of course, being the coach he is. I didn't have daily for long. I had him only for two weeks. <sighs> and, and and just in those short two weeks, he like essentially sculpted me to like what I- What you are now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Or what you can do now. Yeah, what was the reason yeah. you weren't throwing against Wasabi? So in boxing, you can't have the mentality of I'm scared to get hit. Of course not. And that's what I had in the back of my head. I was scared to get hit. I was scared to get knocked out. You, and you can't have that. Mm -hmm. If you, you, you have with boxing, you have to just go all the way in. Otherwise, you're gonna kind of be half-hearted with every punch. Mm -hmm. You're like, oh, like that. You know what I mean? Instead of like going through, you're just yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm not on all that, man. Yeah. I mean, when you asked me to fight the Sadman Charity match, remember? Mm -hmm. Allow me. Unless there's not mad bands there, I mm -hmm. don't like getting hurt, bro. Mm -hmm. Allow me. So you you wouldn't take a fight? No, genuinely. Hand on heart. Right now, I, I, I said to Dej, I've I said, offered I, you I, a mil right now to fight Dej. A mil, 100%. What am I, an idiot, bro? Mm. I think I'd all plan how he's going to knock me out. So look, <laughs> I'll dodge left, right, and then uppercut me. Knock my tooth out as well. I'll make it loose. <laughs> oh, no, I'll do that. But bro, like that's the point I'm trying to make. I understand the value of money, but mm. I feel like you got to love something like that to do it, bro. Mm. Would you fight? No, never. See? see? No. Okay, uh, and what's your reason? Just because of the fact that I don't, want to get knocked out yeah my, same thing mm, as me bro you don't want to get hurt bro yeah. it's it's not my bag no, bro. You, you get knocked out it's on the internet forever forever yeah, that's the one thing one thing i want to ask you but what i mentioned earlier was pressure right from mm. from jj you losing those fights obviously your brother he's got this mentality that is absolutely Winning, like yeah. ridiculous which mm. is it's just i'm gonna win at everything i do which he's mm. done in life um about the tommy fury fight um but what i want to say to you I, is I, I think you won that <laughs> do you reckon no i like tommy yeah, like, yeah. I, I, I really like yeah, tommy, tommy i can't lie is one of the nicest guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's yeah, proper yeah. nice. Isn't so it? nice. Yeah. I remember when I first met him, he was just trying to have like this one bravado, like yeah, angry. Yeah, like, I just, just went up to him, I talked to him, he was just chatting. Nice guy, yeah. Very nice guy. That, that night, what do you think? Generally, hand on heart right now. Hand on your effing heart. Who yeah. do you think won? JJ. Who do you think won? I think it's a draw. Yeah. So do I. I think it's a draw. Wait. <sighs> I genuinely think, it, again, remember, this is coming from someone that doesn't really understand boxing, but I'm front row, bro. I'm seeing what's going on. Yeah. Tommy lost the point, right? Uh, no, JJ, JJ lost the point. JJ lost the point. He hit him in the back of his head now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was it JJ or was it Tommy who lost the I'm point? I'm pretty sure that Tommy was- Don't quote us on this because yeah, you can tell us. No, it was Tommy, Tommy lost the point. Yeah. 
That's what I said. Yeah, Tommy no, lost. No, I think JJ did. No, Tommy lost the point. Okay, well, I, don't, I need to do my thought with JJ. So I, that, don't quote us on this, okay, peeps? Because That's why I'm saying that JJ won the fight. Because Tommy lost the point. Yeah, I think it was but a for draw. me. If you're meant to be honest, and for the sake of there the... wasn't much exchanging happening, yeah, so what, what we have to kind of take the minute details. It was just bare of this. It was just bare of the, whenever now JJ will try to engage. I think Tommy was trying to grab him up and vice versa. But, I don't think there was much punching going. But on. the reason here's the thing though: what you're not realizing with that fight, Tommy couldn't like settle. Yeah, JJ was just too erratic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it may look like he was doing like yeah. some dumb shit. Yeah. But it was just so erratic that it was just so hard for like uh, for Tommy to settle. No, we, yeah, cause, I cause agree Tom, with that. Tom, yeah, because Tommy's a boxer, you know what no, I mean? No, 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 JJ no, no, was mad at right. One you know? thing I say about JJ though, yeah? What I love about him, he reminds me similar to Deontay Wilder, which is I've got this absolute hammer here. Mm. I might not be the most cleanest boxer like Anthony Joshua, Wait, where they all, look, all look clean as Shakur Stevenson. Mm. They look like they know mm. what they're doing, right? But with, with JJ, and I love, what I love about his coaches is the fact that they should just really hone in and on this ridiculous... The fact that he's... <laughs> so it says here, Tommy had a point deducted. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah so yeah. you're right. But I'm saying, as in, with oh. JJ, he should just really just sharpen his tools and be that guy that just has this crazy bang that comes from nowhere. It might look unorthodox, but guess what? If that connects with you, mm. night, night. Mm. And that's what I love about JJ. Fair enough, he might be doing this little thing that everyone makes you joking about, but mm. if he connects you with his bang, it's, it's crazy. And he can also take a punch as well. So... I respect that from JJ, but in that, on the night, I think generally I would have been happy with the draw. So when I did hear Tommy Fury one, I was like, mm, I don't know about that. If I was, I was a boxer, that. yeah, um, called Razor Ruddock. Right, and he's, and he's got the uh, Ruddock smash. Yeah. So it looks like he's going for the body, but he goes straight for your Face. head. Yeah. Uh, and like so many boxes, they just couldn't read it. Uh, Mike Tyson did the uh, smoked yeah, got, yeah, twice. Right, but Mike Tyson's mm. one of the yeah, goods. Yeah. So well, then when you are losing, when you were losing these fights, because yeah. I remember there was a part, I think there's a bit of uh, what I've watched where JJ yeah. comes in and is telling you why the hell aren't you losing and to stop boxing. Mm. What kind of advice is he giving you? And then, because a lot of people can see that as harsh and being like- Sorry, like, what happened? I'm not, so I, whenever, when whenever, it comes to boxing- yeah, Whenever Deji does, had his uh, losses, I think JJ, there was a video clip I saw where he was basically basically telling them just to quit, right? Now, I, I can tell you why. Why? So this is this is how he's get, smiling. This, no, this, no, this is the best way to get like through to me. If you tell me, hush, like, hush, no, like, no, if you tell me you're you're a failure, you're crap, you're this, then I'm like, I'm, okay, I'm, I'm gonna prove you wrong. Yeah, that's that's and that's what I'm trying yeah. to say because I want I want the people to have to see that to give JJ a fair chance because at the end of the day, like when I'm watching that, I'm thinking in my head, that's your brother. Yes, you know what I mean. So your brother knows you the best. He, he so, knows what he's doing. Yeah. So in terms of us now sitting at home thinking that's so harsh, it's like maybe some people like that tough love that I mentioned mm. to you, but some people don't. So I'm, and even if he is harsh, shut your mouth, man. It's not your brother, innit? Yeah. Like, okay, I'm, you know, here, like, here's, here's like, another, like Leon, my uh, my PT. Mm -hmm. So Leon, that's 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 his style. It's tough love, mm -hmm. and that's like the best way to get through to me. Don't get me wrong, I hate him, mm -hmm. but like, but you're meant to hate your PT. Yeah, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, because yeah. he wants the best for you. Yeah. And like that's the only way to like really get to me. Is Leon still yeah. PT now? Uh so I need to contact him, but I do want him to. Uh, Work with me, yeah. Hopefully, man. Why not? Yeah, Why not? And please. talking about boxing, then, bro. Next opponent. Who was the last fight you had? Was it? No, not Fuzzy, was it? Swarms. Swarms. Which yeah. you, uh, what happened to that fight? I beat him. <laughs> yeah, that was yeah, Swarms, yeah. Swarms quickly. I thought you was going to, I said off camera, I thought it was going to be you that I was going to fight Ed Matthews. I wouldn't be fair on Ed Matthews. But I mean, he lost, but still wouldn't be fair yeah. on him. So it wouldn't be fair in the respect that you actually d up him. Yeah, I'll destroy him. Yeah, so who do you think would make sense for you in terms of the next fight? Who would you want? I mean, I've been saying it. I want a fight that makes sense. And I also want to fight someone who's got numbers. I want, I like, like okay. a Bryce Hall. Okay, so I come to you right now and say, there's Joella. Yeah, I'll fight Joella. I'll, I'll, um, the uh, hide and seek uh, mm -hmm. with the sidemen. The yep, sidemen yep, hide yep, and seek. Yep, yep, Joella yep. was there. I yep. was telling him, I want to fight you, Joe. Oh, decent. But then Joe was like, yeah, but I want to have like a few tune-up fights before we yeah, fight. Yeah, yeah, which is fine. Which is so fine. That's why I which respected is fine. him. I can't lie. Can he swing yeah? Uh, well, he, the only fight I've seen it was him and JJ and... Mm. No, here's the thing though with Joe. Yeah, JJ dealt with him. That was the first fight. That was the yeah. first future fight. Yeah. Oh, yeah. see, I see you know, I don't know yeah. nothing. But here's the thing with Joe. He's, a, he's another nice guy, man. Very nice. I was trying, I was trying to like, like yeah, psych him out and yeah, like get him. But to, then just talking. Oh. He's a nice guy. It's just hard. When, I you know that it, Ethan man. and Joe are meant to fight. Is it? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Fight, yeah. It's, it's not Ethan would have dealt with him now. I don't know, Ethan's never fought, so I don't know what to think about it. I just know that Joe's fought, and obviously- I don't know, when I when I look at Ethan, he just looks like a strong man. Have you not seen Joella? Stocky, bro. This Is he, guy, yeah? Yeah, come on, bro. Joe, oh, fair enough. I just don't, anyway. don't, I don't, I just don't that, know Joe yeah, like that, the heavyweight though. champion in the world is Nice and Fury. You know mm. what I mean? Which has got like, you know, you see Nice yeah, and Fury, yeah, yeah. bro. And, and even Francis Ngannou. Huh? Francis Ngannou, you mean? 
Oh, because they're fair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, All right, enough. would you fight any of your friends? Because I feel like Kenny and Gib will never fight. No, that, I reckon you know that, what I mean? that fight could happen. The, uh, no, I don't think it will. The, the only reason it didn't is because I think um, it's, it's, Kingpin. I, yeah, no, it's, it, I'll, I'll say on Gib's side. If Gib really wants that fight, it will happen. Kenny wants that fight. Because I remember there was a time where this is when I started now following Ke Kenny's career like a lot more and I started going to fights with the, the beta squad and that. I remember it was trending on Twitter that they everyone wanted them to fight, but then in the end it didn't happen. So I, in my head, I actually haven't asked Kenny this either, but in my head I thought, right, they're brethren, so why would they fight? Or is that not a thing? I don't think they're brethren. Are, they, are they not friends? Well, Kenny I, and what I would say regarding the whole situation is I feel like from what I've heard of it is the fact that if if Gibbs not getting the bag he feels like he deserves, then he's not gonna fight, which is mm. I think is a fair. I respect I think that's that. fair, bro. I respect that. You know what I mean? Like, obviously, Definitely. Kenny does want to fight, but I, I'm I'm sure that Gibb doesn't mind fighting either. He just I'm thinking, he's thinking in his head, put the right change in my pocket, yeah, then I can yeah, go out yeah. and scrap. No, I respect you know what I mean? That. Which I think is pick up Gibb. That's the way you should same be. way Kenny's my brethren. I think Gibbs man's man's close brethren yeah. as well, and I really like. I like Andy. Gibb a lot. I really like. No, Andy. Horrible, you know, horrible football player. Yeah, no, her own, her own I discovered yeah, that yeah, the Sadman yeah, match, but lovely human being. Do you know what? Gibb a lot. You know my Vinny Hacker fight. Yeah. No. No. Yeah, oh, yeah, he doesn't have a box. I do. Go on. Okay. So my Vinny Hacker fight. Yeah. I wept. I was is it? frying after it. And then, right. and then? And then Gibb is the only there you person go. There you go. Yeah. who came up to me yeah. and like gave me a hug, being yeah. like, don't give up, like carry on. Yeah, you see? Gibb is. Oh, what? I love him. Yeah, I'm telling you, Gib bro. is sound. I'm telling you, I bro. like him. Yeah. I'm telling you, bro. That guy's solid, bro. He was nice to me, Simon Trainer, man. Bro, that's, that's an incredible soul. Another person that was believed in man's grind from the beginning. I think I had under 10K subscribers. We used to go out and watch films together, bro. This guy's. Oh, no way. The people that took me in early was Burnt Chip was number one. Because mm. well, this is way before, like, he was friends with Extatini and Alfie, which is another one of my, my boys. He, he was like, yo, do you want to go go-karting? And this is under, when I had under 5,000 subscribers, bro. I was like, what? You guys want to go with me? Do you know what I mean? So it was kind of like going out of Chip and then me and Gib on the way. And it was kind of like, these guys are bringing me in. So I, I always have some profound love or like respect for these guys just because of the fact that they didn't have to do anything for me, but they decided, you know what? The same guy seemed like a cool person. You know what I mean? Mm. So that's why I'll forever have love for Gib. Every time he fights on a night, I'm always there to support him. Um, anytime anyone does anything from, from, the, from the past, I always try to show them love. You know what I'm mm. trying to say? So... Big up those guys, so what, 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 I'm going to ask the awkward one. Would you fight Kenny? No, he'll never no. fight Kenny. So, but this is what I'm saying. Why? Yeah, because they're both fucking trained by Daily. No, okay. Even yeah, if, but no, YouTube even if, world's different. Cool. Maybe in a real world boxing, I know you. there must be like some technical... I, I, I wouldn't let that fight happen. Why? No, it's not, Why? It's like, okay, Terrence Crawford... All right, cool. You, you both knew they was getting two M's each. Hypothetically, I know. Yeah. But you both knew they was getting two M's each. Yeah, you wouldn't fight. let the man fight. Then they're fine. They're yeah. Fine. That's fine. Let me come on now. That's just stupid not to. At the end of the day, they spar each other how many times. So mm. it's kind of like, all right, fuck it. Oh, that's good. I didn't even know you looked spar together. Yeah. Yeah, but they, it's, it's like, okay, like Terrence Crawford and Shakur Stevenson, they're like friends. You'll never see them fight. Why okay. though? Same way, uh, what's it called? Daniel Cormier never fought Cain Velasquez. How about this? In UFC, Cain Velasquez was the champion of the heavyweight dis division, I think, or the light heavyweight, one of those. And then DC was waiting for him to leave before he even tried to contend for it. Then when now Cain Velasquez had left, then he went now. Okay, him. cool. Let me make this hypothetical then, yeah? Just to make everyone think a little bit different. Let's just say Kenny's the world champion, yeah? Of yeah. boxing, yeah? yeah? You're both in the same division, but that's your dream. You've been doing this since you was a young you and all you want to do is the world champion. Mm -hmm. You're not going to take that fight. Oh, come on, boys. No, I'm, okay. What's the uh, point no, okay, of doing no, no, it no, 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 no. we all want to be the best at what we no, do, in, bro. Okay, in that respect, then, yeah. Yeah. I'll, I'll probably... You, you would. Yeah. yeah. So think, you I would, think... but right now it doesn't make sense no, to you because he's your brother. Respect, That's a different it's response. It's different in the respect of a YouTube game. Like, YouTube fighting compared to... You know how many fucking people this guy could fight? And I'm not Kenny. Like, you don't have to do that. Okay. Like, unless, like I said to you, there's extreme, it's like extreme circumstances where someone comes up to these guys and say, here's two million each. Well, mm. yeah. Like, I'd fight tomorrow for two million pounds, even though I get smoked. You know what I'm trying to say? But it's like. There, you can navigate around this boxing scene on YouTube without flipping having to fight Kenny. Like that's just so stupid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you know what I mean. First. But I just thought right, I'd ask it quickly. I asked about Gibb. Yeah, quickly we're gonna move on. But I want to ask you one last question. Yeah. You could fight someone in six months' time. Mm -hmm. Give me three names that you want. Oh my God, you're... Joe Weller, Bryce Hall, Jake Paul. Official call out: Joe Weller, Bryce Hall, Jake Paul. Now you know what. We're gonna be covering boxing I'll be events real. now. I would fight Logan. Say swear. I'm, I mean, I know he's left the boxing Bro, why team. are your eyes spreading like that? He fought Floyd Mayweather. Do you think he fears anyone? Before fam? we move on, 
How was that See? day? See, I've reminded fighting you, innit? Floyd so, fucking money. You're Mayweather. spreading your eyes like that now, innit? No, Bro, if because you of the fact Floyd, that he wants who's... to fight his brother's business partner. No. So obviously it'll be, there'll be like no animosity, no malice, like in the build. I guess we'll, we'll be, we'll be showmen. We'll yeah. like make, we'll sell the fight. Yeah. But it'll be fun, man. Yeah. You can't tell me that. Yeah, I don't, I, but Desi how's man getting Logan? punched up fun? I don't get that. Yeah. Throwing bangs and how's that fun? You don't feel it? Adrenaline, yeah? Yeah, it's, you feel that though. The, the body shots, oh, yeah, body, body shots. shots hurt. Yeah. Face shots, you don't feel it. Maybe that's just you, bro. Nah, honestly. Basically, <laughs> I think it's maybe the adrenaline. Crazy, you'd fight Logan though, yeah? Yeah. But sorry, um, bad habit I've got of cutting chunks off sometimes. Uh, why wouldn't you, sorry, tell chunks about the Floyd fight. Floyd fight, ah, oh, amazing. The build up for that was was immense. It was crazy because I remember I, I came in there, kind of like, you know what, like, let me shit talk, Floyd, this, that, blah, blah, blah. But then Floyd said one thing being like, don't, don't listen to the all these promoters. Don't don't try and do just be you. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then I was well, like, that's what I told you. Remember? Yeah, yeah. Because I remember I was talking to him before having that fight, and I was like to him, bro, just in, enjoy the occasion. I said, mm. this is Floyd May Mayweather, bro, fifty and or fifty one and or whatever his record is. I said, you can't get into his head. Mm. Nothing that you say is gonna get to him. Just go out there and enjoy yourself. And I generally, when he went on that stage and he's mm. smiling, just no, he, he's, he's a nice guy. Yeah, bro. What's right. So all of this whole thing is it's just a bravado. Yeah. Like when we were in the ring and I was talking to him, nice guy. What sort of things would he say to you like in private? Like, did he give you any advice for your career? Did he say anything like, oh, no, he just gonna, he's gonna keep going. He said, it, how skilled is he really like, Jalen? I'll be real. Yeah. There, there were times where I knew I could just, just give him one. <laughs> and I saw it, so I was like- And he didn't? I, I just didn't. Why? You're lying. I know, here's, no, here's the thing, so. Are you crazy? No, 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 so. Think of it like this, okay? So let's say there's a cave, there's a dragon in that cave. You're not gonna, you're not gonna, you know. <laughs> he so didn't want to say, unleash. unleash him, yeah. Yeah. I don't so wanna, do, so, yeah. so yeah. do you reckon Floyd didn't go to his full potential? Okay, no, no, no way. No way. No way. If Floyd went all out, we wouldn't be speaking to him today. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's the realness, bro. Floyd Mayweather, that's, that's the GOAT. He's yeah. the best boxer of all time. Mm. Mm. Yeah, to some people, of course, anyway. I completely get what you The fact that you thought three steps ahead is very smart because mm. you play chess. Mm. So that's why. Because you see me, if I see her opening, I'm ripping it. Yeah. And then we'll see what happens How'd you after. Do it? How'd you do it? I was just going to look at What? Did that... <laughs> yeah. And just dig in. <laughs> and when I dig in and he looks back up, then I go. No. Yeah. Think, no, think, about, like this. I'm out think about like this. Yeah. Round five. I'm, I'm there on the ropes. I'm just like, it's round five because it was a six round five. Yeah. It's round five. Screw it. I slip his punch. And bang, give him a black eye. And then his coach are there, no, his, uh, his corner's there, like, you know, with- uh, The ice that, thing. Yeah, the ice yeah, thing, yeah. being like, oh, you got a black eye. He's then pissed. He's pissed, I swear, I literally see it. Then I'm just like, you know what, let me, let me piss him off more. Let me do push-ups. <laughs> and the sixth <laughs> round? So the camera didn't, didn't catch it, but yeah. yeah, but then sixth round, he's, he's going hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and, but no, but I was taking it, but yeah. then um, Kenny Bayless was like, yeah, it's over. Uh, did, did he but, hit hard? Hmm? Did he hit hard? That's hard box. No, so here's the thing. His punches, they're not hard. Yeah. They sting. Uh, they're, they're like, that's they're like whips. Oh, uh, he whips you. They're like, oh, it's like, oh, they're like sting. Even the ones on the face sting. Oh like, my God. Wow. Yeah. The fact that he fought Flame over is crazy. Yeah, it's it? amazing, bro. What it's amazing. Man. I, wanna, I wanna talk to you quickly about, man. You, what are your feel, feelings towards like the polls now then? Um, I respect Logan Paul. I respect, I respect them both. Of them. Good, like, I good. think what they're doing is amazing. Yeah. The fact Jake, Jake is, uh, single-handedly kind of helped UFC with pay, isn't it? Like, yeah. I swear the fighters get paid more now. Just Apparently, because yeah, of, because of the way what? Just because yeah. of Jake Paul. Yeah. So, he basically, he basically scared off Dana White because obviously Dana was fighting all these fighters that are mm. taking fights with him saying like, you need to get paid more basically. Cause Dana apparently doesn't pay his fighters as much as he should do. Allegedly, and that's why Francis Ngannou actually left and started to take boxing fights with flipping these guys, Tyson Fury. Now he's got uh, Anthony Joshua coming up. Mm. So, what's, what's your opinion on that? On the payment stuff? Oh, no, no, not payment. Uh, AJ and Francis. Oh, AJ is gonna piece him up. Let's be right. AJ is AJ is gonna deal with him, but I think AJ just needs to be careful of that of that heavy right hand. Is this AJ's biggest fight? Money wise, potentially. Yeah, but, but money, like in terms of opponent. Usyk. Usyk. Oh yeah. Usyk was a. 
fucking terminator, bro. Yeah, I, remember I went to both fights. No, the first fight, second one was in Saudi, I think. First fight, I remember I watched Tottenham. Goodness gracious, great. I don't know much. Do you know, do you know I'm AJ? interested. Usyk, I watch all the big Usyk ones. Was was different, man. I love AJ. Do you know with AJ? He was go- it was kind of like going through a pathway. It was just, when he lost, yeah. he kind of lost himself. But he, but he lost against Andrew Ruiz. That's for me, that yeah, was yeah. very confusing. That day yeah. I was so confused, but I knew that on that get back, he was going to GBG, get mm. back gang and move nuts. See, that's a prime example. But remember I was saying earlier, like sometimes you can work so hard and sometimes it's not your day. Again, he got cocky that day. Let me land. I didn't, mm. I didn't watch that fight. I I again, I don't really watch boxing, yeah? But... One, what I know of AJ, I know him personally. That man works hard, fam. Mm. I know he probably worked. It just didn't happen, bro. No, mm. but that, that day was different. Okay, well, sorry, he, I didn't watch he, it. He, he rocked Andy Ruiz. He rocked him. Yeah. And then you know when you rock someone, you try to just kind of run up, finishing them off, right? Mm. Obviously, on that time, he, Randy must have gained consciousness properly, or like he gained whatever it was back, mm. and then just kind of sparked him with one. Mm. And obviously, now when he's got caught off guard, he's now trying to find, come back and do what he did back to Ruiz, but he was trying to search for it too much. Kept, got left exposed and kept oh dropping. God, I'd love to get AJ on this podcast. But but then the Usyk fight, for me, I think he came in with a different different game plan. I don't know why he tried to come in and actually like outbox Usyk. Like that's just most likely not going to happen. I think he should have just used his brute strength and taken out Usyk. But that's you know how he boxes though, from what I've seen. What? I feel like he's more like technical. Like He's technical, but he has that little bang with that can take you out. But I didn't want. I didn't really see that one much in, in the Usyk fight, and that's f- probably the reason why he lost. But I'll be real. I feel like he's found himself now. Yeah, now, yeah, now, now the new he's, coach he's got and and what he's been uh, doing. He's, oh, he's got a new setup. A whole new setup. I, be, I he, love AJ. Man. I love so but, uh, bro, I, I love the bro, guy. He shows bro. me so much. Yeah, I knew, yeah. bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, bro, I did a whole campaign with him on links. We were both ambassadors. Oh yeah, yeah, man. That's my dog. I, yeah, I, I brought my friend my Kyle with me, still. KGD, and I love it. He showed him so much love as well, man. So I love it, and he's so he's got so much manners, bro. So polite. How you was explaining Tommy and. I know what you mean. What's the other person you said? Tommy Fury, Joe Weller. Yeah, and Joe Weller is exactly how AJ is. Lovely yeah. human being. And I like AJ because he said it'll beat Jake Paul. Huh? He said it what? Yeah, he, he, said said he said I'd beat Jake Paul. Oh, I love that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. There you go then. It supports. Go on, you want to move on? We're Quickly, too much. I'm going to say, like I said, next week is Valentine's. Mm-hmm. So, Deji, when it Wait, comes... Wait, is it? Uh, well, technically when this video comes oh, out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 we are filming this on January, in January, but um, next week is Valentine's. Yeah. So, Deji, are you a romantic person? If I know, like, I'm only romantic to a girl who gives me effort. You ain't romantic, man. No, 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 no. Wait, <laughs> wait, wait. wait. I'm, no, I'm only romantic to a girl who give, gives me gives me something back. What's you know the what most I mean? romantic thing you've done then? I've taken a girl to Barbados. That's nice. That is romantic. Yeah. But describe romance to you, like what you know. If, if we're talking about what your yeah. first thought is, because paying for some, paying for a nice trip is lovely. I think that's yeah. thoughtful. I don't think that's romantic. That's why I was thinking. So I'm thinking. We're, we're talking, know, what what's your definition of romance? What, yeah, what you did on the trip? Yeah. What was it? So, so when you landed, there was petals and that on the bed and that, or was it just straight with the early dog? No, 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 no. He just wanted it. Yeah, no, yeah. Because no, 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 you can't wait, just fly up and be a baby. Just yeah. Go on. No, no, no. So, so don't get me wrong. Like, I, I feel like. The, whole, the petals and all that, I feel like it's too corny. It's, corny. it's not. No, it's, it's not. not. It's, corny, it's not. Man. It's not. It's not. I love all that. I love all of that. You know, look like sometimes flowers goes a long way, you know. You ain't got even book a no, flight. No, okay, no. I feel like if you buy a girl flowers, you're you're messing with their head. If you don't if you, if you don't plan to do anything with them. If I'm if I go to a girl, <laughs> no. No, if I if I see no, a girl I'll, I'll buy honest. her flowers. He's on my arm on. Yeah. If He's I, yeah. just slinging then. No, no, yeah, bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, listen. Stop! Stop, man! Stop! No, 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 no. 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 So, like, good. If I if I if I buy a girl flowers, yeah, 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 yeah. Just spreading them out. Chestnut no, sectors. if I buy a girl flowers, yeah. and I don't have any intentions of like going any further with them, yeah, that's not fair on the girl. I, no, I hear that. I hear, you know I hear I mean? you're coming from. I hear what you're trying to say. He's trying to say if it's just an enjoyment, but your, your company. What? Well, so you buy you buy flowers for links? Yeah, I have done. No, yes. that's, that's why. That's we're saying thank you for that. Because for do you, you know what it is? Like, it's, it's, <laughs> what I feel like it's so similar to of like going on dates, like going on more of one date with a person and taking them to nice places and making it nice and the ambience in the room is good, bro. That could easily mislead a girl as well. So what difference is it me doing something nice for you, getting you some flowers because I know you like roses, and taking you for five dinners in a month? I don't, I don't see the difference. Who did you take to Barbados? Your ex. Uh, is it ex? No, it's a girl who I knew for like a week. Oh God. <laughs> nah, he's my brother though, man. No, but can I be real? I ain't done it, but I'm on all that. 
You don't have too much nah, money, man. Nah, I'm on it. <laughs> However you guys <laughs> are doing. Sky. Wallahi, hey, bro, it must be. You must do. If you watch Chunks' assumptions video, you would have saw when he showed me his bank account. Then he told me no, to show me mine that. and I didn't do no, it for I, a specific I didn't, I didn't reason. That's fake. A man named Money, money Long, <laughs> man. Keep doing that. Can I, but why? Did you, uh, like, did you really fall hard for her? That's fine. No, Kid, so, why not? No, no, no. no so, I'm, not, I'm, not, my, I'm not saying it in a mocking way. I'm just trying bread. to. No, no, so in terms of, like, love languages, I'll say mine's quality time. And my own. In Barbados. Let him talk, man. Let so him talk. My, like my way of knowing if I like you, I need to spend time with you. And I spent time with her and I realized that she wasn't, she wasn't the girl for me. It's okay, do you you could have gone, wait, no, he could have gone please. to Cornwall no, in no. a cottage, bro. No, fuck spent Cornwall. five bills. Fuck Cornwall. You could have <laughs> gone even. to Nando's. Yeah. yeah. Found out what No, kind no, of but that's not long enough. I understand what he's saying. He's saying you wanted to spend an intense amount of time yeah, with someone. Do you get what I'm saying? But you didn't need to, you could have gone to Isla White. Bro, yeah. two the, bills. The amount that he probably spent on Barbados, he could have like rented the whole Nando's for a week. No, like, yeah, yeah. there's no issue. No, no, but then I, but, got a but then I hear you, but everyone's different, innit? So like- Some people like Nando's, some people like the beach. It's no, fine. no, yeah, no, yeah. it's not even that, but we all live a different lifestyle, innit? So like I can go and buy that little jacket that I wore in the last ep, not but me. someone maybe has to save up for that. So you got to remember, just because we're saying Barbados, it might not touch the sides for bro. Do you get what I'm saying Def to you? So definitely not. I don't mm. think, I don't, I, maybe we're reading that bit wrong. So when you were That's deciding to him. take this girl to Barbados, did you think that she would be the one? Yeah, I, I was showing her, no, no, I wasn't showing No, 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 but you I, can't no, laugh because no, you no, catch feelings quick and so do I. That's why I'm not even laughing at yeah, that. Yeah, I figure like this. So I got invited, so uh, my boys, they said, yo, we got, we got a table, like food, not, yeah. like, not like, uh, yeah, yeah. like food, like yeah. you want to come? I was like, oh, she's with me. Can I bring her? Yeah. And they were, like when I brought her with me, they were like, damn, yo, she's a dime piece. Like, yeah. yo, she's a dime piece. Yeah, that's yeah. right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, Do you hang out with like 1940s oh, gangsters? Oh, oh. Like what's, so what's the deal? So you wanted to be seen with her? Huh? Yeah, yeah. That, yeah that was one. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so she was so leng. So when you told this dime piece that you were going to fly her out <laughs> to Barbados, <laughs> what did she say? These 1940s yeah, gangsters were going, but yeah. that's a dime she, she piece right there. She took time off Like, she just like, I said book off five days. She's like, yeah, fine. And she, booked, she literally booked her five days for me. Brother. And then. You see if I was a job. <laughs> yeah, I'm going anyway. And someone <laughs> said to me, look, get on the, was it, you can take her business. Of course she did. Not private. No, no, not, not private. <gasps> no, 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 not private. First class, first okay. class, first class, first class, first class. Oh, that's any, not first class though. No, 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 yeah, that's still I, mine. I'm taking but really any, good first class. Yeah, yeah, you have so taken me first class. My brother, yeah. first time I went first class as well. But if someone said to me, PJ, nah, do you know there's people living like that though? KSI. What, KSI? Does he own his own PJ? About, talk about that fucking family holiday recently. Uh, to Dubai. But Because KSI own his own PJ. No, no. no, no. no oh, but he lie. charters them. I'm, I'm, that yeah, you've trip, done that. Yeah, I know, but... So I've had a couple of times. Yeah, no, no. That trip was such an eye-opener. Just that, <laughs> no, because just seeing what... The, the, the private jet... <laughs> Bro, it was, no, it's it, different. It was 100 bags. I think it, it was yeah. wham! Yeah, is see? it? Bro. Wham! Bro, 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 he showed me pictures of my life because it was filming with him. was 13 bags and only sat like two people. His one was 100 bags. It was him, his mum, dad, and JJ. And the way they were living, they were staying in the same hotel room as who? Uh, Kendall Jenner. And she was still logged in on the Netflix. Yeah. JJ's different, bro. You can't chat to yeah. him. Yeah. They, they, they no. used the Jenner's that, <laughs> Netflix account. That trip... <laughs> <laughs> that trip was such an eye opener. Is it? I can't lie. It made so, you realize you're broke. No, I need no? more it bread. It made you realize that you're broke. <laughs> yeah, because I wanna. I need JJ, more bread. JJ's money's different, bro. I need yeah. more bread. Have you not seen his box at Arsenal? That man are different, bro. You yeah. can't chat to him. No, I've been yeah. in there, I've been in there. Yeah, 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 yeah. That day, that I remember that trip because when JJ was telling me about it before he was going, because he was. I remember there was a trip that you went to go to, but it got cancelled because the plane. Yeah. I remember the plane. I still remember that, that one. Bro, as well. That plane was what? Yeah, you see? No, but this, the next one was even bigger. This guy only does PJ. He's different now, man. Yeah. So, okay. so, so, bro, shout out to him. But all right, cool. So, when you were doing something romantic, which was Barbados, yeah. what did you do in Barbados? Everything you could do there. Yeah. Everything. Scuba diving, swim with dolphins. Okay, no, apart from the like water sport, I can't do that. Yeah. Oh, you don't I, do the water sport? I can't swim. Yeah. Oh, right. Right. <laughs> but anything else. Nice yeah. little dinners. And, yeah. and what did little you like linen about trousers, linen hmm? shirts. What, did, what didn't you like about it? Um, I don't want to say it on camera. Yeah, yeah, okay, I, cool. I, I like I that. respect it. All right. I no, like but you could have just easily said that me and her just didn't like yeah, really yeah, yeah. Get, get along no, in no, terms she, of- she, Lovely girl. Yeah, lovely there you go. Yeah, there but he, go. he's right. not like you. I feel like he's like me. We can't help but just say how it is. So you're mm. better off just not saying. Okay, cool. Fair enough, mm. fair enough, fair enough. That's fine. No, but she's a lovely girl. Lovely, lovely girl. That's as long as she's a lovely girl. Um, Would you ever do that again? Like yeah, 100. Okay, cool. Um, Hey, can you take me to- <laughs> I'm on order. Yeah. All right, so- Yo, wants to get flop? What is your dream date then, Deji? 
Dream the oh. Barbados. Dream oh, I'll be real, I'm a simple guy. If yeah. you just t- took me like to an arcade and we played Tekken or something, yeah. I would love that. There you go. I like that, man. You still have that set, that, that child in you, that inner yeah. child where you just kind of like to do stuff what you did as, as a kid. Look, I want to be the one taking you to like extravagant things. I don't want you taking me there. Yeah. All right. In that case, then, I actually want to see how Deji is sitting on a date and um, right in front of you, as you can see, that's Samantha. Um, and I, know, I changed the name, not Samantha. Okay, uh, did you say past experience? Yeah. Uh, Rosie? No, 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 not Rosie. No, you have to talk to me. Rebecca. Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Yes, yeah, that's okay, Elizabeth. This is a little I've, I've never known an Elizabeth. You can call oh, me no, you can call me Lizzie. Lizzie. Yeah, okay, cool. Lizzie. So right. there's Lizzie right there. Mm. I want to see your Riz. You want to see my Riz? Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Alright. So, so, so what? We're on a date. No, 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 look, 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 look. You're moving. This is, wait, this, no, no, no. Forget moving. This is how we're doing it. We're on a date, yeah. So he's already drawn me, yeah? Mm. But you're the waiter now. You're coming to take orders. Okay. Don't do it long though. Don't do it long. Just quick orders are uh, just put it this way, there's three things on the menu. Cool. Yeah. Hi, uh, are you, is your table ready to order? Yeah, yeah. Uh, are you ready? Yeah, I'm all right. Yeah, I'm ready. Um, so what would you like then, sir? Um, so I would like to order <coughs> for the lady. Wow. Good. The first thing, yeah. please. Yeah, perfect. Are, are, you, are you cool with that? I'd like to order myself. Are you? That's okay. Oh, okay, no, of course. Yeah. Sorry, my bad. Can I have um, the A5 Wagyu? Yeah, A5 Wagyu. Not the, yeah. not the 50 pound one, the 300 pound one, please. Oh, 300 pound, okay, cool. Yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, something I'm, funny, sir. No, 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 sorry no, about that, sir. I, I, can I get, I would like the same, please. I'm a madam. I like the same. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'd like the same, but I'm like, all right, cool. Um, yep, yeah, and what else would you like? Would you, anything else? Um, two tequila shots. You want to have a little drink? No, I'm not drinking. Um, I'm driving, so a bit boring. Um, <laughs> well, I'll, I'll have two tequilas for myself, please. Okay, um, cool. Three pineapple Malibus. Um, yep. And um, the sea bass starter as well, please, for me. Yep. Perfect. With the uh, shrimp popcorn chicken. I'm being you're taking a piss. <laughs> you know what I mean? I, I would have just left. <laughs> if you're ordering all of that, that's, that's, that's wild. But you, t- you told me you took a girl to Barbados, so I thought... I could order the food. <laughs> no, because you want me to leave and come back. No, no, no. It's it's okay. It, 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 am I allowed to all this? I'm not dead. Are you are you gonna eat all of it? I'm I'm hungry. You're gonna eat everything. Yeah, there. I, babe. I haven't eaten all day. You're gonna finish every. I'm, single, un, I'm hungry. Yes. All those drinks too. You've, you've seen the pouch. So you're having those two shots all to yourself. Yeah. You sure? I love a drink. Okay. All right. Thank you. End scene. Okay. So yeah, actually. I don't know. Wait. It's not on. It's not on. Oh, okay. Is that that? All right. Cool. Um, and is there Wait, anything else that you'd like? Give me, give me two seconds. Okay. Two seconds. That's, sorry, sir. Don't you think that was a bit rude? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gone. Oh, he's gone. End scene. <laughs> <I'm gone. laughs> that was okay, wrong, no, of, that was wrong of him to leave. Now, now talk to me. You, why would you say it's wrong? Wrong no, of him to leave yeah. and wrong of him to judge me on how much I ordered. Oh, wow. That's how I feel as Lizzie. Okay. Why? Okay. Right? I'm hungry. Yeah. I would have dealt with the tacos, the, sorry, the guacamole, the yeah. sea bass, the chicken, and the A5 wags. Okay. I would have dealt with that. So then, Desi, what was your problem there? I just feel like... Just... Tune like an ATM? Yeah. Mm. You know what I mean? Okay, then what we're going to do is reversal. Roll reversal. Reversal? Yep. All right, okay. Can I have the paper? Um, give me a second, guys, please. Yeah, I'm with you right now. Um, what would you like, ma'am? Um, I would, no, I'd like my man to order for me, please. Oh, okay, cool. Um, hmm? you got to do the voice. Hey, you got to oh, do the voice. Uh, okay. So start again. You got to start again. <coughs> Three, two. Oh. Hello. Um, are you guys ready to order? Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, so, uh, Savannah, what is it you, you'd fancy? Um, could you could you order for me, please? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, just everything apart from the red meat, right? Um, surprise me. Okay. <laughs> um, can I have uh the sea bass, please? Yep. Um, and the grilled chicken. Yep. Is that is that for me? Yeah. Excuse me? Uh, sorry, is it the sea bass or the chicken that threw you off, babe? Uh, try again. Go again, please. Okay. Um, um, is there any reason that your girl sounds like Max Kadar or? Uh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. <laughs> hey, big up Max, though. <laughs> you know what video killed me recently? <laughs> That beta squad one where he come out in the green suit. Hey, that's right. There 
there is no one that speaks like Max. How did Max think he was going to get away with it? No, That's oh, crazy. brilliant. All right, cool. So I love them little role plays. I live for them. Desi, where yeah. have you been that is your favorite place on this earth? Seychelles. Was it Where's that? Good? Where's that? Where's Africa. that? Africa. I've never been yeah. in. I've heard of it though. Oh, is it actually nice then? Yeah? I didn't know it was enough. Do you think it'll be a nice uh, destination for a honeymoon? 100%. Is is it it come on, come no, so I took a girl to Seychelles. And How long had you known her? No, no, no. So I knew her for a while. Right, like okay. Maybe like three weeks or four weeks. <laughs> <laughs> I've been saying three years. Oh, man. Okay, so how many... Okay, you know, before we even get into it, what places have you taken girls? So you got Seychelles, Barbados. Well, yeah, Seychelles, Barbados. Oh, where have I actually gone? Now it's hilarious. Just those two are sufficient, brother. Uh, Venice. Oh, very nice. Very cute. Um, Milan. So what is wrong with London? No, I'm sorry. <laughs> Here, you know, here's the thing with London. It's too bait for me. Yeah, Fez. That's 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 it. Like Fez. when I was going to uh, Barbados, actually, people were coming up to me, being like, "Oh, can I get a picture?" Of this yeah, but yeah. it's not I as much. Mm. But it's not as much. Like he, I, 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 he's really what what, uh, what what Dave said. Baby, I go he for a man. Then, what's good? Then the what's good? Then no, the that, petrol station. Yeah, but do you know what it captain, is? Bro. Like when I even went Melania. Don't get me wrong. I took pictures, but bro, five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's not crazy. Lovely. Mm. Yeah. Do you get what I'm saying? Mm. So I actually understand where he's coming from. Like, it's, if anything, it'd be a. It's actually a bit annoying that he has to fly out in order to enjoy like it's quality Seychelles time expensive. with a girl. Mm. Mm? Seychelles expensive. It's Barbados is more. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's not that. It's, it's what, pricey. What, what, but what's not, there to do with Seychelles? It's it's like same as Barbados, like water sports, beach, sightseeing, and all beach, that, yeah. all of Good that. Food. Yeah. yeah, very like fish orientated. Oh, I, mean, I avoid I that. Fish. I, avoid that I mean, Bar Barbados is literally the exact same. Yeah. Like, you yeah. love no, bagging. You love fish. Where did this salmon? Coins. So what's wrong with that? That's just as far as it goes. I know they'll give man to each and loud man. Bro, he's you, being weird. I can't. No, no, I can't. I, like, I know he's I'm, I'm more than fish him. He myself. Fish. Huh? Barbados, the fish is like chicken. It's probably it's uh, yeah, amazing. Yeah. Then I might have to go there. Then. Yeah, fresh I like promise chicks. you. Yeah, I, on yeah, my life, yeah. you will love it. Are you I sure you didn't have like uh, COVID there, so you, your, your smell was a bit gone, or you Because <laughs> <mean, so, laughs> I had cereal the other day. It was like oats. Yeah, you see, it's a bit there. What's he on about? So, How was the fish like chicken? Yeah, they not honestly. No, I, I swear, you know it's it's because you know because you know it's like proper. You know, like the fish. No, the fish. No, no. Listen, no, no. The fish in this country isn't as good as the fish in like overseas. No, I hear him mean? though. I hear him. I hear him. You know, I, I, maybe I'm not. You know, no, he. Uh, hey, look. Hey, dude. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna move on to the last section, yeah. and it's something we call mm -hmm. start bench trade. Oh, I love start, start bench trade. trade. Now, you understand the concept, right? So I'll give you three options. Yeah. One of them you start, which is your favorite. Bench is the second favorite, and then trade is your third favorite. But it's called start bench trade. Start bench. Okay. So so I I bench it, meaning like I save it for later. Do you, do you want me to explain? Yeah. 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 No. 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 He's got it. He's got yeah. it. You, yeah. So, got yeah. It. so when I say, for example, I'll say footballers. Yeah. Ronaldo, yeah. Messi, Neymar. I say, well, who are you starting? Uh wait. Ronaldo, Messi. Ne uh I'm I'm starting Messi. Okay. Then you understand. You get right, you so get you the understand. game, and then you're yeah. gonna put on the bench. The other player you don't rate, Neymar. and then you're gonna trade Ronaldinho Ronaldo. in this case, or yeah. Ronaldo, whoever yeah. it was. But um, yeah, okay. go on. I'm ready. Okay. So start bench trade, boxers. Edition. Okay. Yeah. Ooh. Tyson, mm -hmm. Ali, Mayweather. I'm I'm starting. Oh, tough in it because it's either now you're basing it on numbers or like world impact on the Ali. world. Yeah. I'm starting Ali. Starting Ali. I'm a bench Tyson. Yep. I'm a trade Mayweather. Fair play, fair play. I think old boxing heads would say the same thing. To be fair, yeah, yeah, probably. I'm not, maybe, maybe. I would have started Tyson, Mike Tyson. Yeah, like oh, Mike Tyson. Yeah, yeah. Oh, women like Tyson Fury. Uh, oh no, Mike oh. Tyson. Who are you starting then? Okay, still the same. I don't know how you change it. I'm start. I just I'm, prefer the power. <laughs> nah, I'm. I'm gonna start Tyson. Mike Tyson. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I have to. Okay. Mm. And then Ali uh, bench, Muhammad Ali on the bench, and then you're dashing the uh, Floyd Mayweather. Yeah? yeah, yeah. Perfect. All right, next one, cars. Cars. All right. Do you have a car right now? Or no. What car you got? Uh, I've got a autobiography. Oh, very uh, nice. Very nice. Range, uh, range I know, I know. I don't know. Oh, no, 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 Conan's got that. I don't feel him. 
Is it? Mm, so, uh, what do you call it? Just issues. Oh, Constant yes. Issues. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right, cool. So then, in that case, Porsche, Ferrari, Lambo. <sighs> Porsche, Ferrari, Lambo. Oh, I'm, oh. Come on, bro. You know what goes first. I'm start. You know what goes first. I'm going to start Ferrari. Okay. Lost these absolute minds. Okay. Fair enough. I'm a bench Porsche. Yep. And Lambo's getting dashed. Yeah. Fair play. L- Lambo is a, it's a, it's a boy's toy. You know what I mean? Penultimate one. Okay. Wait, and no, no, no. Wait, wait. Wh- why? I would have. Because I would have started me, Porsche. Porsche. I would have benched Lambo yeah. and dashed Ferrari. Really? Yeah. yeah. I think Porsche. But is to the be best. fair, I haven't driven the Lambo SUV, so I don't know. No, I the Ferrari either. SUV. Sorry. I haven't either, yeah. We'll never find out. Well, hopefully one day. Well, he's, the way he's flying girls out to Seychelles and Barbados, <laughs> hopefully he can give us a loan of 250 grand. <laughs> anyway, we're going to move on to the penultimate one. Mm. It's JJ, your mum, your dad. Ah, oh, that's not fair. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? I have an answer for it. What's yours? I said, my, 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 uh, first my family, my mum, my dad, my sibling. Yeah, same. Wait, so trade? No, but okay, like yeah, tra- trade is just the name of it's like the name of the game, but it's not, you're not dashing them. You're just I mean, saying you're who's say lost. One, two, three. One, two, three. Who's lost? Who's lost? You say your mum, your dad, uh, JJ. Let me say. And if it's you. anything right, different, mom, dad, JJ. Yeah, yeah, it has to be. What the hell? Why are you thinking about? I think that? he wants to do JJ. No, 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 no. I'm thinking because you said trade was in like no, that. Like, like, no, no, no. That, in this particular one, it's one. Mm. It's just how we call the game. Yeah, it's just how we call the game. And the last one, which is funny because there's only two options here: start or bench. Okay. Beta squad and sidemen. That's not fair. Okay, but okay. Let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Dum dum. Who you rather dum. feature on? Not necessarily who thinks better. Ah, oh, dum dum dum. That's, I can't ask. <laughs> <laughs> dum, dum, dum. No, okay. but I hear it though. Too much loyalty on both sides. His yeah. brother's part of one group, and then he absolutely loves him with you, man. So you don't yeah. want to discredit yeah, you, man. I wanted to see and at the same time said, discredit. If he said start sideman, because I would have, I would have been like this. Even though I would have understood it, I would have been because mm. his brother's part of the group. Ask me then. Oh, I already know what you're gonna say. <laughs> start or bench. Start sideman. <laughs> <laughs> bench baseball. Yeah, fair play. And I'm gonna say. Stop, baby! Yeah. Bench. Sidemen? No, obviously my brother's beta squad for life. Come on, I'm only playing car. I know the beta squad fan base is very, very strong, but my brothers, you get me? One of the reasons that my career boosted as well. But I can't deny that every time I have films with Sidemen, oh, no, it's, it's 40 plus million yeah, views. Yeah, it's crazy. No, every single time. I've never been in a video of them and it's not got 40 million plus. Before you end up, wrap it up here. What's been your favorite uh, be- uh, video that you featured with the Sidemen? Favorite? Um, it was the the travel one. Do you know where, where we all had our own different cars? Yeah, but where did he go? I, we just like- I drove around. Like, yeah. who's, your, who's your partner, JJ? Yeah. Yes, and then- JJ and Even. I really liked the cooking one that you, you know, did, you and JJ. Yeah, and yeah, partner, yeah, that was but, incredible. yeah it was And fun. then what would you say your favorite what, beta video that you've been a part of? We can slink when Harry Costi's tracksuit cried. <laughs> I can't lie. Cried. I don't think you really enjoyed that one. Nah, do you know, the one I actually enjoyed the most, like hands down, was uh, the first Mafia. That there was so one. fun. I, my Mafia there was a lead as well. One. Mafia's so good, so you know. Good. Oh, but you know why you loved it so much? We can't yeah. say obviously the reason why. Wait, no, it will probably be out by then. The way oh. you got finessed. No, no, that was the second one. Oh, no, that's the, second. the first one. Yeah, first one. Oh, I forgot the first one. First but this recent one that came out on Beta Squad. Yeah. <laughs> Me and Nico. Just dealt with him. Yeah, basically at this point. Right. Crazy. So I felt like I was on Seychelles. Big with news. Deji. Nico, Deji, <laughs> and Clarted. Uh, yeah, yeah, sorry, see, Nico, Deji, and Yeah, good one, man. It's a good yeah, one. Yeah. Anyway, guys, we just want to say thank you so much to Deji for um, coming along. Oh, well, well. Thank you so much, thank my guy. Really appreciate, appreciate We also do appreciate Nando's for coming through, showing us love again, man. Yeah, that's Nando's. like I said, I genuinely mean it when I say this is probably my favorite restaurant in London. So the fact that we're working together is a, is a wild special one for feeling. Me. Very special. And yeah, shout out to Deji, man. Again, once nah, again. Th- thank you guys yeah. for having me. We say, we say every pod, but please, audio listeners, if you could go to YouTube and subscribe, man, we really want to get a million subscribers. Uh, me and my brother have achieved great things in life. We won a MOBA award. I think that's the only award we won together, isn't it? Yeah. The MOBA awards we won together, and it would be amazing to have a golden plaque with him as well. What's so a MOBA? Great. MOBO is a musical award black ceremony. origin. Yeah. Mm. It's an award ceremony that's, uh, that celebrates black content creators and black musicians and black actors and actresses and people that have just done good things for black people. Mm. Uh, but 
And me I love and my brother, black. And I love it. But yeah. me and my brother actually did win a MOBA together. Yeah. So we won it. And hosted it one year as well. But anyway, with that being said, yeah, take yeah, yeah. care. Love and guidance. God bless you. Um, cheerio.